What it do, what it is, babies. Welcome or welcome back to my channel here on Watch What Happens Next. By the title, you could tell we dive into the last iteration of the Harry Potter uh, franchise. And honestly, it's very bittersweet. I can't even say I'm excited um, because for one, I know it, I'm, I feel like I'm going to cry. You guys said that I, it's going to be a lot of crying, a lot of sad moments in this movie. So I'm looking forward to it, but I'm also dreading it. But also, too, it's very bittersweet because this is the last movie within the franchise and you guys have watched me watch um the last seven and well if you guys didn't see chamber of secrets i did have that one out but youtube took it down i'm gonna try to put it try to figure out how to get it back up um so bear with me on that one um because i don't have the original footage i have to like go into youtube and try to figure out but yeah um i don't know i'm like I don't want to let this franchise go. Um, I've grown so close to these people, these kids, these characters. Um, and it's going to be really hard to let them go. I also, somebody in the comment section in the last um, video did ask me, will I do a reaction to the, the reunion special? I think it is. Honestly, if you guys want that, I can do it for you. I will put it in the comment section down below. If that the comment gets to a, like 500 likes, I would definitely get into it because it lets me know you guys want it um and if not that's okay too um but yeah i'm very <laughs> i'm dreading pressing play i'm dreading pressing play and it's like it's also catching me off guard because i wasn't supposed to film today i was supposed to film tomorrow because the lighting wasn't going to be good due to the rain but it's very bright today so i'm like might as well so i haven't prepared myself so yes be aware of the emotions but yeah here we are with harry potter <laughs> Deadly Honest Part 2. So what is this? Picking off what we... Was that last? Yeah, last movie. Crazy that he, like, legit ruined that man's grave for his wand. And they are descending on Hogwarts. This is crazy. And now Snape is the headmaster. Well, he's been headmaster for a while now, I think, right? It just looks so gloomy. I don't like this music. And I noticed also too, the music in the first Deadly Hollows, when this part came on, it was of like the clicking of like the necklace. So I'm guessing this sound is gonna come back later on in the film. Oh, Dobby. What is that mirror from again? Cause I can't remember where that's from. It's beautiful here. It was our aunt. Did somebody in the conversation say that um, the Weasleys and the Malfoys are all kin to the Blacks? They're wrong. Except for, well, except for Ron's mother. I think his aunt. I mean, his aunt and them are direct lines from the Blacks. I need to talk to the Goblin. How are you? I know you heard him come here. Alive. Period. You probably don't remember, don't you? That I showed you to your vault the first time you came to Gringotts. Hmm, why is that? How did you come by this sword? It's complicated. <laughs> why did Bellatrix Lestrange think it should be in her vault at Gringotts? It's complicated. Oh, not too much. But he did say I'm reciprocating the energy. There is a sword in Madame Lestrange's vault identical to... Oh, but it's not the real one. But it's a fake. Oh, oh, that makes sense. Who's the acquaintance? As I understand it, he's now headmaster. Snape? He put a fake sword in Bellatrix's vault. I'm telling y'all, I don't think he's on their side. I need to get into Gringotts. Into one of the vaults. Why should I help you? Because you want, you want to stay alive? Want to live? And what? That. The sword? That is my price. Why do you want the sword? It's not like you could do anything with it. You can't even fight. I bet you anything there's a Horcrux in there. Another piece of his soul. But what does she go and check? It's weak. Would you mind identifying this wand? We need to know if it's safe to use. Oh, that's the man from the wand shop. It's below to Bellatrix Lestrange. Huh? Oh, did he take her wand? No, he didn't. Well, he might have. I don't know. Unicorn hair. Ten inches. The fact that he can tell just by looking at it and feeling it is crazy. This was the wand of Draco Malfoy. Hmm. Is it not still? Well, perhaps not. Sense its allegiance has changed. Mm. And what do you know about the Deathly Hallows? 
Elder Wand, Cloak of Invisibility, and the Resurrection Stone. The Resurrection Stone, so it's not the Social Stone. Who wants the Social Stone? I thought the Social Stone was the... Oh, okay. You told him about the Elder Wand and Ooh. where he could go looking for it. Yikes. There's no telling whether he will find it. He has found it, sir. Mm. Like I said in the last movie, we are... We're screwed. We're screwed. He's after you, Mr. Potter. Mm-hmm. We know that, baby. Afraid? There's no hope. You really don't stand a chance. Well, I suppose I'll have to kill him before he finds me, then. Period. We got... We want a mission, baby. Are you sure that's hers? Oh, they're gonna turn... Somebody gonna turn it to her? <laughs> I'm weak. How do I look? Hideous. Yikes. We're relying on you, Griphook. If you get us past the guards and into the vault, the sword's yours. I am the strange. Good morning. <laughs> He's not like, girl, what? Bellatrix is strange, not some dewy eyed schoolgirl. <laughs> She's not a dewy eyed schoolgirl. No, he's right. I was being stupid. Is that Ronald Weasley with the facial hair? Like that? I like Ronald Fisher. He looks kind of. He looks kind of cute. Oh, he looks very on the dark side, but cute nonetheless. You gotta act like her. What? What are you looking at? That's her. That's what she gives. I like the way they animated this because I, I don't think it. Um, the first couple times they they introduced it, it wasn't animated like that. That's cool because at first I think it was like a. Um, it just looked like it was a sheet over them. Uh huh. Oh no, girl, act fast. Would you mind presenting your wand? And why should I do that? I'm afraid. I must insist. I'm afraid you should back up. Imperium. Wait, what was that? If you will follow me. Huh? Look at the man in He like what? <laughs> He's in bliss. Oh, oh, Hermione changed back. The thief's downfall washes away all enchantments. Oh, no. Why didn't he tell them that it changes them back once they go through the thing? Because I'm I'm pretty sure he probably has assisted Bellatrix before. But if he hasn't, then okay. But he has the knowledge. He should be like, forewarn you, hey, if you're going to change it to a girl, if you by chance go through that water, you might as well have another piece of hair because you're going to change back. Just forewarn him. But... I don't know. You gave up the Imperial. Case, you Got you again. Mwah. Him in the size. Is that a dragon? Oh my god, I love dragons. Hey, Nuggets. It's been trained to expect pain when it hears the noise. Oh. It's all chained and bondage. Oh, poor baby. In here, this music reminds me of the first uh the first time he was actually in his vault when he was looking at all the the gold baby that lighting looks so pretty on it like it's just mm. is that cup <laughs> oh what is that <laughs> why are they duplicating they've added the gemino curse everything you touch will multiply give it the soul <laughs> oh god it'll be buried in that stuff it'll be buried in it did he do it? I don't know. Harry! We had a deal, Gregpock! The cup for the sword! What? I said I'd get you in. I didn't say anything about getting oh, you, you out. Oh, you nasty son! Oh my god. That is so dirty. I hope he... Oh! At least you still got Bogrod. It's gonna burn him? Oh, yes! <laughs> Brilliant one. Why can't they use a why can't they porky out? <laughs> now she's a dragon rider. <laughs> she ate with this one. Yeah. You guys, if you guys don't understand, I wish I could ride a dragon. Like I would love to ride a dragon. It's so quiet in them. <laughs> Now, what if he just used the dragon to burn Voldemort? 
Boom, game over. I keep saying this, and I'm gonna keep pointing it out. My love for dragons goes deep. I have a tattoo of a dragon. I have a tattoo of a dragon. I have not named it yet, but I want another one. For I am the father of dragons. I love this shot. The water shot is just so pretty. I feel like everything's just beautiful. The way it's shot, the camera work is amazing. He knows what we took, and he knows we're hunting all crosses. You let him in. Harry, you can't do that. Dang, Harry, you just gave it away. Oh no. Oh, and somebody also told me that, you know, um, Lucius, I think his name is, basically is scared of Voldemort because Vo since Voldemort got out, Voldemort has been like taunting him, which is why he broke his wand just to get under his skin. Um, which somebody also said that wasn't in the book, it's just an addition to the movies, but. Oh! That's what the fuck I'm talking about. That's what you get. That's exactly what you get, you deceiving bastard. You went out there and you thought you was gonna win and skid out with my girl, without my, without my people. Now look at you. In here, Potter. For a second, I thought it was. I know, Dumbledore. Oh, is this what his brother, his brother gonna come? Cause he said it looked like Dumbledore, and we know Dumbledore has a brother, and he's been mentioned in the last movie. That's the sister. That's the sister. Yeah. Had it, but ask yourself, hmm. where would you be if I didn't? They do kind of look alike, though. Him and um, Dumbledore. We need to get into Hogwarts. Dumbledore gave us a job to do. Did he now? But I wonder why he never made an appearance uh, um, Hunting Horcruxes. before the, this movie. We think the last one's inside the castle, but we'll need your help getting in. Not a job my brother's given you. It's a suicide mission. Dumbledore trusted me to see this through. What makes you think you can trust him? You don't trust him? You know the time you knew him. Did he ever mention my name? <gasps> Did he ever mention hers? He didn't. But I mean, why would he talk about his family problems with a little boy? I'm not interested in what happened between you and your brother. Quite frankly, we don't care. I don't care that you've given up. I trusted the man I knew. Now my grandfather told me what to do. He didn't tell me exactly what to do, but he told me what to do. And here I am trying to fulfill that. You are not going to stand in my way. You know what to do. Wait, she actually like, what's going on? Does he talk to her? I mean, like, can she talk back? This is to Ariana, isn't it? Oh, that's her name, Ariana? My brother sacrificed many things, Mr. Potter, including Ariana. The thing that's, like, crazy with this is, like, in this movie, he bas he's basically saying, you know what, Dumbledore did anything to basically get in power. He even sacrificed our sister. But in the prequel, it's basically saying that they had a duel, which is why the sister died. So I don't understand why he would say it here. I don't know, um, cause the way he presented it, like Dumbledore killed him, killed the sister just to get ahead. When in actuality, they just basically, it was accident, like. She's coming back. Who's that with her? Neville. Neville? Oh, you know. Hi, Neville. Actually, I seen Neville all grown up. Neville is kinda cute. Can you do that to you? Why? Today's dark arts lessons had us practice. Y'all real loud. Can the, um, the Dementors here? Because, I mean, they were hovering over that thing. Hey. Listen up, you lot. Brought you a surprise. Baby, it is I. Sit down, sit down, everybody. Don't, don't make this a big thing. It's not, you know. <laughs> I'm happy to be here. Come on, Harry. But where are they hiding it? There's something we need to find. It may help us defeat you know who. Just say his name. Right. What is it? We don't know. <laughs> um, it'll be small, easily concealed. Is it the ring? No, we ought to find the ring. It's mother's ring, right? Well, there's Rowena Ravenclaw's last diadem. Oh, bloody hell, here we go. <laughs> Shut up, Ron. But Luna, it's lost for centuries now. There isn't a person alive today who's seen it. Excuse me, can someone tell me what a bloody diadem is? Right. It's a sort of crown. Snape knows. He knows that Harry was spotted in Hogsmeade. Hmm? In Hogsmeade? Oh, no, the students are marching? Material world! I want Chanel 9 boots. Baby, I don't care what nobody say. That that nasty old drape, whatever is a shawl that he is wearing, I need one of those. That is a good old nasty, like a nasty outfit. Many of you are surely wondering why I have summoned you. No, we don't. It's come to my attention that earlier this evening, Harry Potter was spotted. Harry Potter was sighted in Hogsmeade. Who? Who? No. Who? Any person found to have knowledge of these events will be treated equal. 
equally guilty. So would you, will you kill me as a child? Of Mr. Potter's movements this evening. I invite them to step forward. <laughs> it seems, despite your exhaustive <laughs> defensive strategies, you still have a bit of a security problem, Headmaster. I heard you looking for me. Here I go. Here I go. Madonna, girl, I love you. Woo! Period. Woo. Not you left. Now he ran like a coward. He ran like a coward. But the moment Madonna go step forward was like, you know what? No, you're not going to touch him. What the? I know Ooh. that many of want to fight some of you may even how is he getting in their head like that give me harry potter and you will be rewarded i don't need your rewards what are you waiting for someone grab him what i beg your pardon excuse me period jenny period hermione absolutely not i wish somebody would try to grab him do what you have to do I'll secure the castle. It's good to see you. I love that lady. It's good to see you too, Professor. Ooh. You destroyed Tom Riddle's diary with the Basilisk fact. Because they don't have the um the sword anymore. But it did disappear, so would it come back? We can't keep up you know who indefinitely. That doesn't mean we can't delay him. I'm getting chills. Pierre Totem Locomotor. I seen this a couple. I think it was like a year or so ago on um on TikTok, and I didn't know what this thing meant, but it gives me chills. Protect us, do your duty to our school. This is just dope to me. I, I don't know what other way to put it, like, just dope. I've always wanted to use that spell. Because we're finally fighting back. Like, we're finally fighting back. I don't know, just something about them, like, just fighting back, just, just it resonates in my spirit because for so long, like they've been so scared of Voldemort, but now they're like, you know what? This is our last stand. This is our chance to fight for these babies, fight for our future. <laughs> to put a barrier over that school. Wow. There's not a person alive who's seen us. The dead girl. It's obvious, isn't it? In the bathroom. We have to talk to someone who's dead. Period, the dead girl right in the bathroom. It's very impressive, isn't it? Wait, who was that? The ghost of Ravenclaw Tower. Oh. There's another girl. Okay. I thought it was about the girl in the bathroom. But she was wrong. I cannot help you. I want to destroy it. That dress, that silhouette looks so pretty. What is that? Are those people? Oh, girl, Baltimore has landed. They never learn. Such a pity. Begin. But I don't think they can, they can't tear the, um, the thing down, can they? Ooh! That's what you want, Terry, isn't it, Eleanor? Girl, we're under attack. Come on, hurry this up. You want it destroyed? Another swore to destroy it. He's lied to many people. I know oh! what he's done! I know who he is! He defiled it with dark magic! Girl, can you calm down and get up on my face? It's here, in the place where everything is hidden. What does that mean? My thing is, why are we just now getting introduced to her? Because I thought it was only one ghost girl there, and that was the one that was in the bathroom. <laughs> oh, he, he got the tone too now? Harry talks in his sleep. Oh. Have you noticed? Shooter can't get in, right? Oh. Ooh. Nothing, it decimates you, you try to run through? That's crazy. Yeah, the teeth. Get get a couple of them. Get get a couple. Get a couple. Get a couple. You do it. I can't. I yes, you can. Cause Ron killed one. Now it's time for her to kill one. Not kill one. Destroy you actually, but you catch my drift. <laughs> oh, ooh. one more down, baby. You're almost done. Yeah. Oh, that's right. 
Well, now he mad. But it's his white power can destroy it, right? <sighs> it's destroying it. Is it cracking? It's cracking. Ah! Oh my God. <laughs> it's blowing the whole bridge. Never, never. I know he didn't die. They, they showing this for a reason. I know he didn't die. Come on, put your hand up. Put your hand up. We've seen it time and time. Exactly. We've seen it time and time again. Go ahead. You haven't seen Luna up yet? Luna? I'm not for her. Oh, he love, he like new, new. Who? Um, you get what I'm trying to say. Oh, it's in that room where they were they practicing in the, um, the Order of Phoenix, I think it was. Draco. Please, I was giving you the benefit of the doubt. Please don't prove me wrong. It's speaking to him. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's actually a real crown. Oh, that's cool though. I got a raven on it. Well, well. What brings you here, Potter? I got you the same thing, my boy. Something of mine. I'd like it back. Get it back in blue. Why didn't you tell her? Bellatrix. He knew it was me. Oh yeah, he did not say anything. He didn't say anything. <laughs> Here he is, Hermione! That's my girlfriend, you nutty! Girlfriend? Oh, I guess they must have solidified it. <laughs> what is that? But who called you that? Now they're all messed up, because how are they going to even get rid of that? Would they let them die? Bye bye. We can't leave them. He's joking, right? Harry got a good heart. He got he has a really good heart. If we die for them, Harry, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> and Malfoy about to understand that who the who side to be on because uh, what's that man name? Voldemort would have left them to die. Oh, it's like a three heads, like a three headed dog. I wonder can Nagini feel what he was feeling because Nagini um coiled up when he uh felt that. Is he like actually like dying down because his head is like you can see the veins in it, like it's just crazy. Lord. Dang, he's <laughs> how you gonna kill him because he spoke to you? Don't be mad at him because you losing. Come, Nagini, I need to keep you safe. Is Nagini a, um, a hook too? Cause he said, I need to keep you safe. Is that the reason why she crawled up? It's the snake. And she's the last one. Oh, see, that makes sense. Cause when she crawled up, it's like she could almost feel him, like feel him in pain. But it makes sense probably because she felt the other ones die too. Find out where he is. If we find him, we can find the snake. And we can end this. Why well, he gonna get the snake? Because for one, the snake is always with him. <sighs> Ooh, Lucius, you look bad, love. I did not be more prudent to call off this attack. I do not need to seek the boy. The boy will seek me. Before the night is out, he will come to me. Do you understand? Look at me. How can you live with yourself? Oh, how could you live with yourself? Go and find Severus. Bring him to me. Lucius used to have, like, one of the best bust downs, and now he just been been dwindled to looking like a rag doll like oh my god how was this good to like this is crazy oh that's the girl that, that had a a crush on ron well it was ron's girlfriend for a minute and was he eating her <laughs> they bring everybody out this is just crazy. It's all out war. And this is my thing though. They fighting against the majority of kids. Like these kids gotta be so scared, but also so brave to fight this, this fight. I don't know. But the one resist me. I'm guessing if it can choose you, it can't resist you. But I guess, I mean, they don't want to be in the hands of somebody evil. It answers to you and you only. Does it? Does it not? The one 
Does it truly answer to me? And he can't answer the dumb door that he's dead, right? I am not its true master. Then who is? The Elder Wand belongs to the wizard who killed its last owner. <gasps> so Snake? While you live, the Elder Wand cannot truly be mine. <gasps> no, he's gonna kill Snape. You've been a good and faithful servant, Severus, but only I can live forever. I'm conflicted. I'm so conflicted. Like, is he about to kill Snape? My lord. <laughs> Nagini, kill. Oh, God. That's a terrible way to die. I mean, he could have just said about a cadaver, um, but he being attacked by a snake. That's just so sad. Because I, I'm, I'm, I've always been conflicted about Snape. Like, I mean, everybody know I'm, I wasn't here for his bust down too much, but I feel like genuinely, genuinely and honestly that he was he didn't want to do majority of the stuff that uh, Voldemort wanted him to do, which is why he did things like place the fake fake sword into Bellatrix's uh, vault. He basically he killed Dumbledore. It just seemed I don't know. Even when he killed Dumbledore, it just seemed like he wanted to do it. Give me something quickly—a flask, anything. But can't Hermione, she can't she save him? What is that? Why are they gonna tear? Take them to the posse. Oh, it's a memory? I mean, it's kinda, still kinda sad. I don't know. I'm very conflicted. I'm very conflicted about how I feel. Cause like, I don't trust Snake, but I don't fully like not trust him. It's just so sad. They kill a lot of kids. They kill a lot of kids. <laughs> oh my God. That is so sad. Not them too. I just can't. I really, I'm really trying to consider myself because I don't know. I don't really don't know what to think. I'm gonna tell mommy. You're a freak. You're a freak, Nanny. Why was he in a tree? Is that where they went in that um in the prison of Azkaban? Then they fell into the side of the tree. That's where he Snape lived. Hmm. Did he grow to like her? Oh, that's the. The father, right? Don't say a word against my father. Oh my god. It spoke of a boy born at the end of July. Yes, but he thinks it's her son. He intends to hunt them down now, to kill them, hide them all. What will you give me in exchange, Severus? So base So Snape asked Dumbledore to save Harry. But what what made it what was about Harry? Oh, what what was it about Lily Potter? I can't I can't remember that why Voldemort was after um them. The Dark Lord will return. When he does, the boy will be in terrible danger. If you truly loved her, no one can know. So he was in love with her, but that's maybe that's why he was so um evil towards him because he didn't want nobody to know that he loved his mother. We both know Lord Voldemort has ordered the Malfoy boy to murder me. So he told him. But should he fail? And should presume the Dark Lord will turn to you. You must be the one to kill me, Severus. So that makes sense. It is the only way. That makes sense, because even in the moment, it was like, he was like, that makes so much sense. Because he even said, he was like, Severus, please. It was saying, please stop. It was saying, please do it. A part of Voldemort's soul latched itself under the only living thing it could find, Harry himself. So is Harry a Hogwarts? Of Voldemort lives inside him. Oh my God. So when the time comes. To kill Voldemort, you have to kill Harry? The boy must die. He must die. You guys, I'm not gonna, if Harry dies, I'm gonna, I'm gonna freaking lose it. This cannot be, I, This music, I cannot. You've kept him alive so that he can die at the proper moment. You've been raising him like a pig for slaughter. And it's crazy because you think that Dumbledore liked him and Dumbledore didn't. It's like, 
you like you say you raised him to basically slaughter him. This is crazy. If Harry Potter dies, I swear, I freaking swear. Like it really doesn't make sense. I can't. And I can't believe Dumbledore. I can't believe Dumbledore. I'll go with you. I'll kill the snake. I still don't know what that means. I open at the close. What is that? And that's the symbol on it? The deadly hollow symbol? The resurrection star. <gasps> that's what it is, so he could die and come back. They keep changing the actress. I don't like that. Does it hurt? Dying. I never wanted any of you to die. Frank, they all die for him. You'll stay with me. Until the end. I'm really trying to conceal myself. Like, I'm really trying to. Because I don't want to be a, like an emotional mess. Like, you think this is a mess? If I really unleash my emotions right now, I could be a mess. But I'm trying to conceal it. But how would, can he, like, the resurrection stone? Like, what do you, how do you even, like, you know, get it to work? Harry? No! What are you doing here? <gasps> they got Hogwarts I and um, Hagrid, too. Harry Potter, the boy who lived. <laughs> oh, not an upper room. Not being the upper room. <laughs> We're not going up to glory for a little bit. What is that? <gasps> what is that? Harry, you wonderful boy. Wonderful boy, you, you basically didn't care if I lived or died. Let's be clear. I mean, you did because you gave me the stone, but whatever. Professor, what is that? Is that the part of the, uh, Vold Voldemort that's supposed to be in him? But why do I look like that? A part of Voldemort sent here to die. You were the Horcrux he never meant to make, Harry. That's crazy. Harry was a whole Horcrux his entire time. I didn't even think about that. I don't know. This, this. I feel like this franchise was just done so well. Like it was just done so well. And the snake's still alive. Yes. And I've nothing to kill it with. Help will always be given at Hogwarts, Harry, to those who ask for it. Is that the um the sword, right? And the sword did disappear from the goblet's hand. Professor, my mother's Patronus was a doe. That's the same as Professor Snape's. So that means that Snape led him to the sword. Professor, what should I do? Is he dead? She is so pretty. Dead. And I love how, like, the Malfoys, honestly, they're not that bad. Like, they're not really bad people. It's just that the circumstances, and um, even in that moment, she just cared about her son, and she was able to lie for Harry just because of that strength. Like, she knew, just like Malfoy knew, that Harry isn't the bad guy. What was that sound? Just imagine the agony. But even though we know that Harry isn't dead, but they don't know that Harry's not dead. And I know Hagrid gotta be really sad. Like I know he's not dead, but it's making I'm still. I don't know. I don't know. Harry Potter is dead. No. From this day forth, you put your faith in me. Absolutely fucking not. Harry Potter is dead. <laughs> Join us. I want that bald head blown off his shoulders. Like, for real. Well, I must say I'd hoped for better. <laughs> Not too much. I'm sure we can find a place for you in our ranks. I'd like to say something. Oh, period. Not a speech. Doesn't matter that Harry's gone. Stand down, Neville. People die every day. No. He's still with us. And here. That look that he's pushing this on. It's not over! <gasps> <gasps> Neville at, got the sword? Was he waiting for the um the sword to be revealed? <laughs> Were they are they leaving him? <laughs> Period. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh.
Oh, period. Oh, period. Yeah. But Hermione, you don't have the sword. You gotta wear it. You gotta get the sword, baby. <laughs> Ron. Not my daughter, you bitch. Period. <laughs> <laughs> period, Molly. <laughs> I love that so much. Yes, somebody about a goddamn hussy. Let's finish this the way we started. Together. Oh my god. Ew. Oh, Vera Kadabra. Period. That's wild. How did I go from cheer to cry? <laughs> You're not that strong, love. Is it truly Harry's? Dang, so he was really only living if because of the um the whole crisis. I really want a Harry to be like, I've had a cadaver. Boom. And he just blew up. I feel like the the Thanos of it all. It's cool, but I really wanted to see Harry decimate him. Why didn't it work for him? The Elder Wand. The wand never belonged to Snape. It was Draco who disarmed Dumbledore that night in the astronomy. <gasps> so it was Draco's. The other night when I disarmed Draco. Oh. At Malfoy Manor. So that means... That's why it flew to him. It's yours. It's mine. Harry, you better be the most powerful wizard out there. I guess because I mean you don't want nobody else to use it because technically if he dies um then the next person who like who killed him will basically own the wand and then that person could be evil and then it could be a whole cycle again so I definitely get it um why he would but what's left for them like do they fix Hogwarts up 19 years not a time jump oh they said kids Oh, you guys had kids together. They became the new parents. I'm gonna miss them. Well, guys, that was Harry Potter and the Deathly Hollows Part Two. That was the last um, Harry Potter movie within the franchise. Um, it's just so bittersweet because we now are done with this this series. I didn't think I would ever honestly get here. When I first started, I was like eight movies. That's a lot. Because at the time, I was only used to doing maybe, what was it, like, um, Hunger Games. And Hunger Games, what, had, like, Hunger Games, Catch a Fire, do, 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 I think it's like, five, th four movies. And so, I was still just used to doing that many. But with eight, it just seemed like it was unachievable. Um, especially because the movies were so long. And I was just like, wow, I really just can't do the over two-hour um, movies. But I am glad that I was able to um, embark on this journey. Um, because I have grown to love these characters. I have grown to just love um, everything about this series. To all of you who has been with me since the beginning, I thank you. Um, I know I dropped the first um, reaction um, like a, over a year ago, I think it was. And then I picked it back up a couple, like uh, just a couple months ago. Um, but we have been flying it through them. And we flew through them. Um, I don't know. I don't know what else to say. But thank you guys for being with me on this journey. Um to the, the subscribers that I've gained from this franchise, I thank you so much and I welcome you here into this family. Um, let me know in the comment section down below what other franchises you guys would like for me to do. I'm thinking about doing um, How Do I Train a Dragon. Also, let me know if you want me to, to finish um, Lord of the Rings because I can't do the last one. Um, and also, The Chronicles of Narnia. Even though I've seen the first one, I haven't seen the rest of them, but I want to do that. I also, you know, want to dive into Star Wars. I have never seen Star Wars. Um, so let me know any other franchise movies that you guys would like for me to get into because I definitely can get into it. But I also will be continu continuing any gay content, any, you know, gay and LGBTQ plus content here on the channel. Um, if you have not checked out Young Royals, definitely check that out. Um, definitely stay on the lookout for Scam. I will be doing Scam. I will also be doing a poll if you guys want Druck or um, WT, what's it, WT Fox? And yeah, 
I just can't thank you guys enough. And thank you guys for once again for allowing me to feel safe enough to be vulnerable on this channel. And I know sometimes as creators, and I thank you, and I want to also shed light on this. A lot of you guys comment and say, you know what? Well, I thank you for being vulnerable. I thank you for for just crying and feel and, and you know expressing those feelings the way I expressed it. And because a lot of other creators don't. And I want to say, and I want to highlight this, that maybe a lot of them don't feel vulnerable enough on their channel. It's because maybe they're not vulnerable people. Maybe they want to be vulnerable, but they can't. And also, um, maybe their audience isn't as acceptable to that. So it's, it goes a lot of because I can tell you this. As a person, I personally cannot cry in front of people that, that I've known for years. I don't necessarily um, cry. Like, my body fights it. But that's why, it, all in all, it goes to show that you guys have created a safe space or given me a safe space that I can feel bored enough to cry here and unapologetically. Because, like I said in a comment, that previously I would cut the crying out. I would cut it down to a minimum. But as now, I'm embracing it. It does not make me cringe. It does not make me feel like, hey, oh, well, they won't want to see this, so let me cut it out. Or maybe I'm doing this too much. It makes me feel seen, heard, and just, you know, just embrace when you guys comment, well, hey, thank you for doing this. I felt the same way. So continuously doing that. But also, if you're watching other reactors, definitely show them that same love because they definitely deserve it. Um, and so they can feel safe. Um, yeah, I'm just excited to see what's next. Like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Also, put in the comment section down below what you thought about it and what's next. Like I said, give me any other franchises. But also, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already because the majority of you who watch these video are, videos are not subscribed. I see it. I see it. So definitely subscribe if you want to join this family that we are growing here. On to the next thing. I send everybody to understand my birthday, ton love and abundance of peace, love and positivity. And I hope that you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Bye, guys.